this is the century of uh, New South Wales rice and it is going absolute gangbusters. Uh, rice, Australian rice feeds like 20 million people around the world uh, but New South Wales grows far and away the majority of rice of anywhere in Australia so it's a really important crop for us and it's one that in, employs many many people right throughout the Riverina. As an industry the growers have had um, a, a big input into it and uh, we're taking everyday challenges as they come and, and trying to streamline everything. We're also known as the, um, we've got the identity as a clean and green uh, industry, so that helps our markets and we strive for that as well. We normally grow a fragrant rice in Kaima and Topaz is now uh, the new variety to come out, which um, with their markets the way they seem to be going is, is a good fit for us, giving us a slightly higher yield potential and uh, a good quality of rice. And also, um, it's a semi-dwarf variety, so with the Kaimus they were quite, quite tall and used to uh, have the tendency to lodge. With um, Topaz, it's a shorter variety, so come harvest, uh, it should be a little bit easier for us to um, commence harvesting without having anything falling over on us. It's the first time that we've really had a fragrant rice grown in New South Wales. It is a, a, a temperate uh, growth uh, varietal and normally those would be grown in the uh, Asian areas but uh, of course it just suits our Riverina region down to the ground so uh, that's why it's an exciting new development for the rice industry in New South Wales. <laughs> well, we took Topaz um, up to Hong Kong, Singapore, Malaysia and Thailand and we did some blind taste, taste testing with various segments of the market and then it, it came out number one which surprised us. The response for Topaz has been huge overseas and one of the reasons is because the fresh air and the water, it's just all the conditions are absolutely premium in Australia. So it's going to really like be a, I think it's a huge deal to be able to buy a beautiful fragrant jasmine rice that's Australian grown. Well domestically uh, the fragrant market is the biggest imported component of the market and we don't really play in it uh, that extensively. So Topaz is a product that allows us now to compete with the best quality Thai rice from around the world. By the next harvest we'll have commercial quantities, so uh, harvest will be March. Uh, by May, June we will have product on the shelf and we'll have, certainly have product in the best restaurants around Australia and we'll be starting to export it probably around uh, May next year. I'm actually um, quite um, excited to have a, have a go at Topaz and um, you know, being a fragrant grower uh, this is just another, another step and we'll see how we uh, go with the yields. Ready, set. Yeah, New South Wales Government through its Department of Primary Industry supports the rice industry in New South Wales very strongly. We've got excellent research and development partnerships with many different organisations. The research, both varietal down through uh, precision ag, our, our general environment type things, it's, all, it's, it's a crucial part to our industry. It's been a combination of both marketing ambition, scientific application and um, very solidly supported by government. Uh, it's all come together in a matter of three years, which is quite remarkable for a breeding program. Uh, yeah, we're very excited. The growers were telling me how, you know, they've worked, with, and the scientists, um, that they've worked really hard to get to hit all those really intense jasmine notes, which is, I, I guess, harder than we realise. Um, but they've done it, and it's just, it's just really it's such a beautiful rice. It's just so beautifully floral and fruity, and it's got a beautiful bite to it, so it's absolutely gorgeous.